Hello, Berkshire Hathaway Home Services sales executives for our video message of the week. All right, this week's message is very powerful. I entitled it, Conquering Your Fears and Change Your Life Forever. Now, my goal today is to give you some insight of how you could break through any fear that you have. But to start, I have a few questions for you. And I guess one very important question is, what is your number one fear? As you think about fears, what's that number one fear that really is inside of you that you think about on an ongoing basis? How is this fear stopping you from achieving what you want and what you deserve out of life. That's so key. What is it, what is this fear doing to hold you back? If you had to think about this fear costing you something, what would be the cost that you would say this fear is costing you to carry it around with you on an ongoing basis? And what activities could you do to work past that particular fear? I'm going to share with you four ideas, basically four solutions that hopefully will help you work through this particular fear that you have. First one is meaningful conversations. A question, what conversations are you avoiding and with who? It may be an uncomfortable conversation, but it can be a meaningful conversation if you take the time to have it. How about physical activity? What physical activity are you not doing, are you avoiding, are you planning to do, but never get to it? Are, is it something that you've wanted to accomplish in your life, but you're fearful to do so? How about mental exercises? You know, maybe one of the fears that you have is really opening yourselves up into certain situations. So mentally, Okay, to do that, to open you up or put yourself in what you would call an embarrassing situation or it's perceived to be embarrassing, okay, to you, will hold you back and that fear is holding on to you. And finally, for this key solution aspect is skill enhancement. You know, as your confidence builds, and you have the answers within yourself to deal with different situations as you increase your skill sets, you enhance those skills, those fears are easily or more easily pushed away because you know what? You're more comfortable in your ability and your resolve to work through those types of issues. Now, in closing today, there's some rules of thumb that I want you to think about as you go through and you work past this particular fear. One, you should not be comfortable, okay, when you work through these fears. Don't look to be comfortable. In fact, I want you to be uncomfortable. That is the point. Your body, okay, your body and your mind will react and not always wanting to react in a positive way. So you need to fight through that. That's the opportunity. And here's, here's the prize at the end of all this. If you do this and you fight through it, that's where true personal growth happens. You get uncomfortable, you work through it, you stay with it and you say, wow, that wasn't as scary and as fearful as I thought it would be. Have a great week, everybody, and we'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.